Oh jeez. Oh. oh wow. The latest patch of Smash Ultimate brings me oh so much joy for those people who main these characters. By the way, you guys realize that this image is not from uh, Smash Ultimate, it's from uh, Smash 4, right? Like, <laughs> it's from Smash 4. The, it's basically the best Smash game ever made. Way, way slower. Wait. What the heck was that? <laughs> man, I didn't I didn't think they would buff these characters, man. King K rule is actually better. Buff the puff, buff the puff indeed. This patch is like Christmas, man. This patch is like it's like going to your grandma's house and grandma made your favorite food. It's like come on grandma. You so sweet grandma. Come on, man. While a buff is not necessarily a good thing, for example, you don't want to buff Wario Swap, that's really unnecessary. This latest patch, this latest Smash Bros Ultimate patch, was like a Christmas gift to those who main back characters like King K. Rool and Kirby. Granted, there are more buffs than nerfs in every patch, but it seems like every nerf is like a hole. Do you remember when Peach got her forward air nerf? In my humble opinion, this nerf should have never happened ever. If you want more of an in-depth explanation into why nerfs are just not beneficial nor as optimal as buffs, you should check out this video right here after mine, of course of course it will be in the description below i remember nerves that were made for king k rule were just unnecessary as well just because newer players are getting bodied by king k rule doesn't mean you should nerf the big guy i think the latest match ultimate patch let us know that there are characters that just need to be fixed buffed ultimate is just in a perfect place right now or rather in a better healthier way than smash 4 ever was there's someone else <laughs> that we're probably gonna mention later at the very least in a future video before smash ultimate was about to just you know leave get uh, moved on and ultimate was just the new thing this pretty much confirms that palutena is probably not gonna get nerfed joker is not going to get nerfed uh snake snake has not been nerfed but that is a good thing because nerf is bad yes no a mechanic just strong like arson would get nerfed but no he is not nerfed he is not nerfed but for some reason they nerfed peaches forward air like come on man come on man in those five months that peaches forward air has been nerfed i swear there's probably more than a dozen games where a peach main was going to win a set, was going to win at least a game, but the forward air did not kill. That's <laughs> that's a bummer, man. That's 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 gonna make me legit cry. Overall, I think you guys get my message. I mean, I think what people really love to complain about is uh, combat mechanics. I mean, this is why this is why people want WAP to be nerfed. This is why you know they say Ken is bullshit this is why they say hey let's nerve arson because comeback mechanics are just insane let's be real <laughs> i mean you know there's no way that uh, there's gonna be another uh comeback mechanic type of character in the game right i mean we had we just had joker like bro we just had joker oh i see this is the part of the video where i just showed you a clip of the new character with the comeback mechanic with the usual rules when terry's damage meter rises up to 100 percent or higher and in stamina mode when his overall hp drops to 30 percent or less you'll see this go icon at the bottom of the screen at this point, if you enter the specific command, you can initiate the power geyser you see here. I am scared shitless. And that is pretty much my take on nerfing characters. Hope you guys have a wonderful day. I'll catch you guys in another video. And as always, stay gassy.
Now, if only there was a way to remove ROMs from the game.